that we start tonight in Warwick County, where a couple is talking tonight about their arrest on child abuse charges. One of them is a foster mother. Nina Shepard and her boyfriend, Thomas Birch, were arrested yesterday and bonded out of jail today. They're accused of abuse and confinement of Shepard's seven foster children. Tonight, Eyewitness News Ann Powell spoke with both Shepard and Birch. I actually just got out and I feel like I didn't get to speak my part until now. Nina Shepard and her boyfriend, Thomas Birch, say they're being falsely accused of abusing seven children in their home. I mean, when I go to trial, mm -hmm. I'm gonna win it anyway. I mean, yeah. it doesn't matter, it's, oh, it's okay. bogus. There's two sides to every story. Detectives with the Warwick County Sheriff's Office say the kids in the home claim they were hit with a belt and locked in a closet. After deputies executed a search warrant, court records show they found evidence that matches the kids' claims. Found a belt and uh, we were able to, to see the, the room that the children were supposedly locked in. Um, it was a dark room off of the laundry room. The couple was booked into the Wart County Jail, Shepherd on a $750 bond and Birch on a $1,000 bond. The bond sparked outrage on social media, including the pair's landlord. It's not on the police and the detectives that make the bond, it's our judicial system. I feel like not only are they failing the community, they're failing the children in our community that we have lost that are being abused. Shepard is adamant that the allegations are false and tells Eyewitness News the person who reported her has a problem with her personal life. She just was not happy with the fact that we put, you know, that we put our relationship into the whole situation. But you could ask the kids too. They loved him too. So there was nothing wrong with either one of us. Shepard tells us she has provided daycare for other children for several years and says those who know her know the truth. They know that I've worked with kids. They know the person that I am. And if you've worked beside me in a child care facility, because I've worked at a lot of them around here, you really know who I am around children. Deputies say the children have been removed from the home. The locking and any type of closets or bathrooms or any of those things, not the abuse, none of it. Uh, honestly, the only truth about it is that they put us in jail. It's, there's no truth behind any of it. Burke's initial hearing is scheduled for June 21st. Shepard goes back to court in July. In Warwick County, Ann Powell, Eyewitness News.